as of July 2nd, 2020, of the 34 tests done, our total number of positive cases has climbed to 250. 117 persons have recovered, but we recorded another COVID-19 death. In institutional isolation, we currently have 120 active cases, 16 persons in institutional quarantine, and two persons in the COVID ICU. To date, we have tested 2,000 668 persons, with 2,418 being negative. Fellow Guyanese, yesterday I made a special appeal to our residents in Regions 1 and 7, where over the past two to three weeks, the number of positive cases has been climbing rapidly. I am pleading with you to stop and spare a thought not only for your safety, but for that of your family, neighbors, and residents in the communities. You need to cooperate fully with the Compliance Division of the Ministry of Natural Resources, the Civil Defense Commission, the Army, and the police, who will be working collaboratively with the Ministry of Public Health to contain the spread of this fatal disease in your communities. Some of you still believe that COVID-19 is a gimmick, that you cannot contract this disease, and that if you are infected, you can easily recover and move on with your life. That may be so, but remember the trauma that your body undergoes when COVID-19 strikes. In this same vein, I also wish to address our repatriating nationals. The terms of whose return includes an agreement to home quarantine for seven days. Why on your arrival in Guyana do you then choose to disregard this and to saunter out into the public knowing that you can potentially be putting at risk the lives of those you love the most? Just a reminder, provide accurate information at the points of entry. Remain at home for the agreed period so that the health officials can call and check with you.